Hello everyone, welcome to Tutorials Point. In this video, we are going to talk about a certain type of cell division process which is known as amitosis. So let us see how a perf cell performs amitosis. This process of amitosis is also known as the direct or incipient type of cell division. Why this is called so? This will be clear from our coming points. This is a type of cell division which is slightly different from that of the normal other types of cell divisions like mitosis and meiosis or meiosis. So this is a slightly different type. Here the synthesis of spindle fibers does not take place which is a normal event in case of other types of cell division process. The absence of chromatin fiber for condensation. So the, during the process of condensation the chromatin fibers are also absent. A very important difference between the other types of cell division and amitosis is the nuclear membrane does not disappear. In other cases of cell division, the nuclear membrane dissolves and it disappears and again after a certain point of time, after the cell division has completed, the nuclear membrane again reappears. So this process is not followed by the process of amitosis. So here the nuclear membrane does not disappear during the process of cell division. Let us see what are the different mechanisms this uh, amitosis process is performing. It involves mostly two different phases or two different steps. First is known as the karyokinesis. So from the name we can understand that this involves the division of nucleus. So what happens here because we have already discussed that the nuclear membrane does not dissolve. So what happens if this is the nucleus, this slightly develops, it grows in size and it develops a constriction in between. It develops a constriction like this. Slowly and steadily, this constriction deepens and it starts dividing. It divides into now, this will divide into two different nucleus. So this is the process by which the process of karyokinesis in amitosis happens. After karyokinesis, that is nuclear division, it is followed by the cytokinesis, which is the cytoplasmic division. This also performs in the similar way like karyokinesis. Suppose if this is the cytoplasm, if this is a cell and it has got after karyokinesis, it has got two nucleus. Now what happens? The plasma membrane, it starts deepening inside like this and then again it divides and the cell divides into two new daughter cells. So here you can see the nuclear membrane, it has not dissolved, but the cell has divided into two new daughter cells. So this is the general mechanism followed by the process of amitosis. Now let us see what are the what are the areas or what are the cells that is performing the process of amitosis. This can be found mostly in prokaryotes like those of the bacteria and cyanobacteria. Certain types of yeast can, can also actually perform the process of amitosis. So mostly yeast actually perform amitosis for the reproduction or for the division. In case of eukaryotic cells, there are many cells which can perform amitosis like those of the cartilage cells, fetal membrane cells, endosperm cells of the seeds. So these are the cells of the eukaryotes which can perform the process of amitosis. Now also in case of the disease cells and also the old tissues, they also can perform the process of amitosis. Now let us look into some of the drawbacks of this process of amitosis. So we know here since the nuclear membrane is not dissolving because of this what happens it causes the unequal distribution of the chromosomes. So the chromosomes are not equally distribu distributed between the two daughter cells. Hence this is a this is not an equational type of division like that of the mitosis. So because of this uh, reason what happens it leads to abnormalities in the metabolism and reproduction because we can understand that not the equal amount of genes or equal amount of chromosomes is passed on to the two daughter cells. So this results into abnormalities in the metabolism and also in the process of reproduction. So in this video we have talked about a process of cell division that is amitosis, how it is different from the other types of cells because it does not involve the or dissolving of the nuclear membrane. We have seen the mechanism how this amitosis process occurs. We have seen the cells which can perform the process of amitosis and also we have discussed about some of the drawbacks of the process of amitosis. So I hope you have understood and like this video. Thank you.